Dave the Shepherd Boy is the story of a life dedicated in humble, childlike faith and devotion to the God of Israel. Our story begins with the annual Jewish feast of the new moon, or the Feast of the Trumpets. On this occasion, Jesse and his family are called to the feast for the sacrifice. It is to be a special event. And the Lord said unto Samuel, How long wilt thou mourn over Saul, seeing I have rejected him from reigning over Israel? Fill thine horn with oil, and go. I will send thee to Jesse the Bethlehemite, for I have provided me a king among his sons. And Samuel said, How can I go? If Saul hear it, he will kill me. And the Lord said, Take an heifer with thee, and say, I am come to sacrifice to the Lord. Call Jesse to the sacrifice, and I will show thee what thou shalt do. Thou shalt anoint unto me him whom I name unto thee. And Samuel did that which the Lord spake, and came to Bethlehem. Behold, young man, who is flowing beard and bells upon the ephod's hem. The awful prophet hath appeared, woe, woe to thee, O Bethlehem. He comes, the avenging seer who slew the Amalekite at Gilgal's shrine. Well, may we tremble. The messenger of wrath divine. And the elders of the town trembled at his coming and said, Comest thou peaceably? Ye sons of Boaz and of Ruth, let now your doubt and terror cease. Uplift your head, O valiant youth, I come the messenger of peace. I come to sacrifice for sin, 
the elder sanctify the place to Bethlehem low I enter in God's messenger of peace and grace let us be joyful thy second son, let yet the next appear. I bring to thee my third son, he surely is the chosen one of Israel. Neither hath the Lord chosen this. I bring to thee yet seven sons, among them must the Lord's anointed be. The Lord hath not chosen these, are here all thy children. There remaineth yet the youngest, and behold, he keepeth sheep. Send and fetch him, for we will not sit down till he come hither. Yonder he comes. The shepherd's crook is in his hand. His face is ruddy with his health. His eyes are sparkling with surprise. A oh, fair-haired boy. We call him the Beloved. Whence comest thou, my son? What is thy name? 
Then Samuel took the horn of oil and anointed him in the midst of his brethren, and the Spirit of the Lord came upon David from that day forward. <laughs> 